So what is this YouTube stuff? What is the purpose of this YouTube channel or whatever? Probably mostly to share what I do and my art and my journey and who I am, but also maybe serves to accomplish a dream. I would love to be able to do what I love, make art, tell stories. So this is mostly to have some sort of digital diary of what I'm doing, how I'm feeling, and what projects I'm working on, all that good stuff. I'm doing a lot of different things and I never know what I'm doing. So that's it. I have nothing planned for this. This is just, I don't know, I'm making, I don't know, vlogs, I guess. Vlogs on my daily week and what I'm working on. I just started new art school and I'm hoping to get a little better than I already am at art and everything in between. So what have I been doing? I've been doing a bunch of different things this week. Uh, I've done a lot of drawings on perspective and others like building, you know, the, the classic draw square in one point, two point, three point, five point, four points. I can't count. I've done a lot of that this week. It's been very heavy for my poor head for like my brain is just melting with all these like squares and sitting and looking at the same drawing for like six hours. I'm dying. It's always a little weird when you're doing projects and you're trying to do like a self portrait kind of vibe and you're just sitting there looking at photos of your own face for hours on end. I'm just like, like girl, what's going on? What are you doing? She's just been staring at me ever since I opened my computer. It's like having a mirror at your desk. It's a little bit absurd. Drawing is weird. I'm just sitting here with these small images. Trying to trying to figure out like compos composition, composition. How do you English? I don't know. It's going okay. I think I have something I want to draw. Do I have the patience? It is Friday. I have nothing else planned. 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 So I might as well. I just need to get myself to do it. You know. I think I've decided which one I'm going with of the sketches of what I'm working on right now. I think I'm gonna try to go with this one, but with the hand, the the arm composition of this one. So like reaching out of uh, this fingerprint hole kind of vibe. I do also like this one. It's more terracotta, -y, which I think is what I was going for, but I don't remember. And it changes a lot depending on the day and how long ago I made it. But I'll, I'll update with the sketch. Maybe I change my mind, we'll see. Sometimes I just open up my drawing program and I'm like, oh, I'll put on the, the uh, oh, I'm swearing, that's great. I'll put on the, the photo I've taken to use as a reference and I stumble upon the last project I did. That is a scary photo to come across. I will, this is the drawing I ended up making from that photo, but it's very funny. It's a very old photo as well. I don't look that different though. I guess it's hard to tell. It's not that great quality. 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 
I'm going to blame this for my speaking. Not my bad English. <laughs> it's weekend, don't judge me. I do love the idea of me being like, oh, I'll just film my thoughts as they happen. And I look back on the videos and I'm like, I've not done anything to my hair since I got up this morning. I've not showered yet because I'm trying to fix my face. Fix my face. I'm trying to clean up my face, whatever, right? <laughs> I'm just like, kind of crazy. Hair is everywhere. And I'm like, it's not even early. It's like 12. I don't know, p.m., a.m. It's lunchtime. I don't do English. I do 24 uh, system, which I guess, I think it's in, in America. It's called the military system. It's just a normal system here, 24 hours. It's 12. It makes sense. I'm sure you can logic your way to it. I'm <laughs> just looking at my hair being like, oh, I look like a nightmare. That's great. I've also discovered that the uh, the wall behind me, it's painted like a uh, uh, not grey, but like dark blue with a grey tint that teeters on no colour at all, but it makes me look very pale on top of my my uh, uh, my table lamp. I I have become a ghost. I don't know if I have just decided that screen recording is just not going to work on my PC. If I've given up, I tried to film it when I installed OBS and everything, uh, but it kept crashing my computer. So I'll just be scuffly inserting photos via editing. We'll see if I can figure out how to do that and showing you what I'm doing. But I've been I've drawn the sketch. This is what I've ended up with. I will be finishing it up, obviously. Um, making it look nice. Will I add text? Who knows? At this point, things will happen and I don't know. Um, and I do not know what this is for. Who this is for. Which, because I'm filming it different videos. And I have a feeling that the video about the drawing is not gonna come out like anywhere near soon. I like this drawing though. I think it's turning out really well. I have no idea how much of this I filmed. I made a bunch of different sketches and a, a different, I, I did a video on all of the, uh, uh, well, I, I tried to film a video of all the idea process, <laughs> but I think, I failed somehow. I'm not quite sure. I might retake the first part as well, because I feel like that's the first things I film, so I sound very much like demotivated. And I don't want I don't want that to be the first thing you see in a video. Also, that's kind of like when you do a sketchbook. That's something I've learned from an old teacher. You never draw on the first page of a sketchbook. You always save that one for last, so when you open the book, it's uh, your progress, you, you're met by the last piece you did, which should, by logic standard, be the best because you worked through the sketchbook. So I'm kind of like, maybe if I film that last, <laughs> I will be more confident. Let's hope. Maybe I'll fix my hair. Who knows? Not me. In like true Danish fashion, it's raining like wild. And I don't know if you can hear it. I just looked at the video I filmed of me making lunch, I guess. I just realized I'm doing a theme of color. I picked out the, the yellow coffee mug for fun, because my pants are yellow today. And then I was like, oh, I'll have some orange juice as well. And then all of a sudden the table was just all 
yellow. I must be in a particularly good mood today. Who knows? I have started editing this video last night. And I did realize I started off my explanation of what I wanted this YouTube channel to be without introducing myself in any way, shape or form. So to that, my name is Emilia Nicodine. And feel free to pronounce that whichever way it makes sense. I had several things I wanted to say, but I have not written them down and now I've forgotten it. So I'm just staring out the window, looking at the rain. I ended up finishing the sketch I've been, the illustration I've been talking about, this video at some point. Here it is. I have not yet discovered if I know how to do this, but I see this on YouTube. And I will try to figure out how to do it. We'll see. I think that's the second time I've said that. I, yesterday I held another session zero for a DD game and i got half of my players to make characters which means i have character portraits for two characters on my first campaign my first DD campaign and i have potentially five character portraits on my other DD campaign that's gonna be interesting I am pretty far along with one of the two from the first campaign. This is it. She's a pirate, if you cannot tell. But bonus points if you can see what class she is. I don't have too much else to say. It is a, the start of a new week. I'm going to do my best to have like a week filmed, a, a week to two filmed of just random things I do in a day, within a week. Um, the projects, because it does actually help me to have a medium to tell my progress. I have essentially given up on making specific videos, because it just makes me think too much about the end product. But for if I do things for them to compare to when I do things like this, when I just update on whatever I'm doing. It's a lot easier and I, I can just pull out my phone and like talk to the phone and say initial thoughts on what's going on. And that helps me a lot more finishing the actual projects I wanted to make videos on. Because I have essentially made everything I need to for that one video that I've been struggling with making because I've made this video on general progress. I just need to figure out how to make it look nice and not be very in your face. And I hope people, I don't know, like what I'm doing because I like sharing art and I like hearing what people think. And I do, I do think that YouTube is a very exaggerated out and about loud place and that's not necessarily me so I hope that this reaches a bunch of people who are a little bit tired of that loud out and about YouTube and maybe you'll stick around see where my career goes because that's the dream to be able to make art for a living oh I did think about I made a video like a year ago about a new sketchbook uh, with the first couple, uh, the first two pages of that sketchbook. I have almost finished that sketchbook in real life now. Tell me if you want to see that, what I've been drawing in it. 